Uh oh. <laughs> Whoops. All right. <clears throat> Excuse me. All right. Starting part two. Hopefully. Let's see, we're actually gonna load it this way. There we go. Okay. <clears throat> so we're starting part two. We'll see how this goes. Uh, last time we went into Uptaden Castle and I died really quickly. Let's see. My dad is still terrifyingly asleep. Playing Dragon Quest. Dragon, Dragon Quest V. Dad's sick. I'm afraid it looks like your dad's gone and caught my old man's cold. I'll have to both stay here until he feels better again. Uh, so do I go back to sleep? Whitey's cold of all things. Well, went out here already. Let's see, let's see. So after I die. Oh, okay. Here's Bianca. Let's see what she's saying. We're going again tonight, right? Maybe we should get some sleep. Yes. So who knows if... Oh, okay. And off we go again. All right. Oh, this guy's in here. Let's see what he's talking about. Oh, he's telling us the same thing you told told us last time. No, oh, but then it gets creepy. I apologize to all my younger viewers who have now been scared to death. <laughs> I apologize. It was too spooky. Desperately sorry. All right, I'm gonna go wail on some monsters in the silence. So I just assume we're going to probably need to grind it out a little bit and get stronger. <laughs> so this is going to be riveting then, if it's just a lot of wailing on monsters. Medicinal herb. If anyone does watch this and feels like 
you're seeing me do anything crazy. Like, oh, you don't have to grind that much, or... You've clearly chosen stupid weapons. Like, I'm not above hearing that stuff, so... Dazzle does. Right. Let's see, but surely, surely there's a way to just see what it does. I guess not. No, yeah, there is. Okay, so we have. Well, is there any way to check that? Is that her essentially kind of trying to push me forward? It's like, we gotta level up. There's no way we can make it through there. Maybe I'm just being stupid. I'm trying to think of what was it that I tried to fight. Oh, we had, there was like a, we got ganked by a party of folks last time. We also are not walking the direction we should be. Funky ferrets. Oh, Bianca. Let's see. Does she wake up after the fight? Is she asleep? No. At least I don't believe so. Alright. Hold up, bubble slimes. Alright, new guys. Oh, can they poison me? We've gone and agreed to something a bit too tricky. I hope we'll just save that poor little cat. Oh, that's what I must have done. Okay. Um, I'm curious how much money I've, I've acquired at this point and if it's enough to buy better gear. Even buying her something better. Could be helpful because she's not doing a lot of damage right now. Although, is she supposed to be kind of like my main magic person? How much money we got? 262. I could like buy her a weapon. So that's the thing. Like, I don't know if it's smarter to go offense or defense just so she could take more hits or if that, you know. Got heal. Use that on me. She has frizz. All right, dazzle. Mm. Okay, okay. <clears throat> so 
if that's how I understand it, then that basically is the, uh, that basically blocks physical attacks, or at least makes the chance of physical attacks a lot lower. Let's try it. Yeah. And so in theory, they should miss. Okay. Or at least miss a lot more often. Oh, five is asleep. Okay. That's a drag. Oof. Oh my goodness. Okay. Well, cool. <laughs> Thank goodness. Oh. Oof. Um, let's see here. I say we start wailing on these guys. Oh, for the love. Well, that's it for Bianca, I guess. Yep. <sighs> Oof. I am tanking this one. Okay, we're running away. Nope. Okay, so we're dead. Wow, that did not go well. Now we get... <laughs> oh, jeez. Okay, so what are we looking at? So if we both die out there, do we lose anything? Is there actually any penalty to that whatsoever? Because they're like, no, surely you wouldn't be so stupid as to die. Can you buy things? Can you buy things from her? You can. I wonder, is the armor guy open? Or the weapon guy is. So they do want you. Interesting. Okay, so it does look like they want you to be able to still buy things and take care of yourself. Okay, what does she need? She could use a shield. It's kind of expensive. How much we got on gold? Oh, because oh, when you die, you lose half your gold. That's what you lose. Gotcha. That is a pain. Well, is there anything I can sell? I wonder. Let's see here. <laughs> hey, how's it going? I am just uh, poorly going through Dragon Quest right now. All right, what can I sell to you? I don't need these plain clothes. Let me sell this stuff. Oh, and there's no music right now because it's nighttime. Do I even have enough? Let's see. Am I going to sell that? No, that's her only shield. Let's see here. Okay, I will solve this. Alright, let's see if we can buy anything for her. Okay, I'm gonna get her. Oh, she can't afford that. Let's just get her a shield. Let's get out of here. Go fight some stuff. All right.
So I got all excited that apparently death, at least dying, at least in this specific scenario, didn't. Well, there was no uh, repercussions from it. But that was dumb. You lose half your money. And there's not a lot of money going around right now, so... Drackies. Great. I say we just make a break for it and just try it. Now if I need to grind real hard, maybe I'll do that off stream or something. It's five. Squelch. Squelch stops their magic, is that right? Not entirely. All right. So we couldn't go in the front door. Can we go in through the cave? Let's try the cave this time. Nope. The front door won't budge. At least we tried it. Yeah. Attack. Right. Ooh. Oh, that's right. We saw King Ghost last time. We didn't talk to him, though. <laughs> I've been waiting a long time for someone to appear from there. Many years ago, there came two. So they, they came to this castle, the ghosts who live now, live here now. My wife miscount, miscount, and I are finding it impossible to rest in peace. How things have changed. I still remember the days. We would enjoy the afternoon tea while watching the flowers bloom. Please, I beg you, banish from this castle the ringleader of these ghosts. Then the rest will follow, one by one. All right. This ringleader will be in the, f Ooh, in the throne room, guarded by his evil minions. You came through a very dark floor on your way here, correct? That is the room for the ringleader. Is working. Just take the stairs up after the door. Just there. Remember that. Remember that. Up. Okay, take the stairs after. I probably should have listened to that a little more. Uh, throne room. Yep. Take the stairs up after the door. Alright. I can't pass him, can I? Okay. He said take the stairs up after the door. Okay, so that is supposed to be the only entrance. That's cool. Stairs after the door. Yeah, there really is. Okay, so they they guide you. They hold, not hold your hand, but they. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. There's only <laughs> okay. There's only one way to go. I think once we're down here, though, we have a little more freedom. We came in. We talked to her. We looked through all this stuff. We went into a weird bathroom. Saw the chandelier. 
Went down these stairs. All right, and then lightning. Could I, hmm. Can I bother fighting this ghost? I mean, I realize I'm probably not supposed to. Yeah, let's just go down the way we're supposed to go. Um, okay, can't cross there. Okay, yes, they very much want you to go this way. So we'll go that way. I won't fight it. Whoa. Whoa. Uh-huh. Something I must tell you. You young people must be more patient before you go run ink off. There is no use in you going directly to the throne's room now. It's too dark for you to see. You must go through the grand hall to the basement. In a jar in the kitchen, you'll find a torch. Oh, I don't remember doing this last time. With this, you will banish the darkness and bring in the light. Easy as fun. Oh, oh boy. That's a weird joke. Is that legit a joke for... Uh... <laughs> uh, oh gosh, I forget what they're called. You know what I'm talking about. Anyway, Von. <laughs> Sorry. That's Zube. I make the rusty door open for you also. Good luck and stick together. There's safety in numbers, remember. Well, I want to see what's up here. Ooh, so this is the way outside. Yeah, this is where we were. This goes, so we need to go downstairs. Yep, 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 yep. That's literally what he just said. Do you say anything else? Basement, get a torch. Okay, can do. Uh, oh, they must make the encounter rate like real low. Fireball and Dazzle. How much is that? Okay, so that's four. We can make it through this. Oh, great! Okay, there we go. Dig it. Okay, down we go. Let's see, what is this a painting of? Anything? Oh, that's weird. What do you mean? Okay. Uh, what was that sound? Okay, so this guy calls in more reinforcements. We gotta get rid of him quick. Okay, now we take these guys on. Woof. Get him. Yikers. Okay, make it. Make it. Make it happen. There we go. Yikes. Okay. Um, how's she doing? Good enough to wear. Is that right? Is she okay? Yeah, she couldn't stand to make it through another fight, probably. So we talked to this guy. Right, so he mentions Nimzo first. This is the first mention of our potential big bad. Oh, okay. 
Okay. You will for sure use this. Okay, that could help us out. And he died quick. They can probably still call for backup though, like no problem. I am out of magic. Am I out of magic? No, I can still heal her. Great. Well, that's just fantastic news. Okay. Looked at this painting. Is there a doorway there? Yes, that's where I came from. There it is. Let's go down there. So we're looking for a torch. That's... <sighs> Are you the torch? I was supposed to be the chief of the castle guards, but I couldn't protect the count from those monsters. If only somebody, anybody, could stop the Grand Master of Nadiria and bring peace back to our world. Alright, so you're just a little fire thing. Okay, I talked to them. Did I talk to them? Oh, they can't stop dancing. It's a drag. Okay, how do we get down to the basement? Stay the night. Uh, sure. Can I just keep. <sighs> oh my goodness. I feel so dumb. <gasps> oh. Okay. This castle's full of ghosts, I'll have you know. You must take care, little one. What, uh, who, who are you? Oh man, oh man. So, did he open the front door? No. Wait! He did open the front door. That was just real polite. Okay, so I do feel dumb. I basically was just playing it wrong. <laughs> it's real stupid. Okay. I came here looking for some sizzling hot treasure. I haven't found it yet, though. What's this over here? You talk to them, they make you... They make you dinner. Ghosts! Get them! Nice! Noich. Okay. Do I talk to them yet? Oh, because they... Mm. Okay, there's an enormous treasure chest. Wax murder. They really... I guess I am... Maybe it's just years of... Years of playing games that don't make it obvious what you're supposed to do and where you're supposed to go. Because I really do feel like this game so far is super duper linear. I mean, these games are linear for the most part anyway, but... It is very clear where they want you to go. And also very clear... How they want you to proceed. This is literally the same thing. Um, But yeah, so far they haven't, it hasn't been anything like, oh, well, you went this way, you miss something. Like, I can't go another way. Oh. What luck, a torch. I 
cats in here and he's trying to eat peanut butter that is allotted for my wife. It is very rude of him. Okay, so now we have the torch. Here's a single ally of poison. That's what Squelch does. Let's dazzle these guys, maybe? Oh, that's gonna really hurt. Oh, that's right, they do magic. Should I just throw some fireballs at people? Are these both... Oh, let's do it. I mean, they're fire-based, but whatever. Don't die. Oh. Well, thanks. She won't revive if we go to sleep, will she? We'll have to see. Oh, man. And that's... that's it. Ugh. So we lost half our money again. Oh my goodness. It's embarrassing. At this rate, we'll never be able to... We'll never be able to do anything. Well, that's nice. Don't do it. Oh. Get him, Bianca. All right. Okay, so from what I've seen so far, they really try to make it foolproof, but I am managing. I'm really managing to uh, to thwart their systems here. Well, I wonder if I can go in the cave now. Nice. Okay, I take it we're in the basement. Hey! Okay, I know where we are. What is that? A silver teacup. Seed of strength. Should I give that to Bianca? That seems... Should I just use that on myself? It's like I'm gonna be by myself for the most part. I don't know who I should use that on. How can you see? You can't really see whose strength does what. Um. Well, okay. I'm sure people are gonna freak out and yell at me, but I'm gonna use it on her. So I'm gonna torch. Ugh. Okay, so that's the only way through there. Go back through the front door. Yep, through here and down the way. I bet it's probably honestly not worth it 
giving her seed of strength. Because unless I... I don't know. And this does. Okay, so we gotta go up, up, up. It's like, I can't tell. I don't think she's doing more damage. Someone correct me if, uh, if you feel that's not the case, but that's okay. See what? Okay. Bye -bye. The wife is playing Animal Crossing right now. Oh, who'd that be? And okay, it's Bianca. Strength plus two. Kassap? That's against magic, is that right? Yes, we would like to go to sleep, please. up there that's where it came from right or no that's okay so I wanted to see what was up this way uh oh interesting okay I got you Okay, I know what I need to do. I want to kill this guy because he drops... Reduces the defense. Oh. Okay, well, let's do that on them. That's defense. Okay. Right. Right, right, right. Because Sap just does one. Because Sap does a group. Sap or er, Frizz Dazzle. Alright, get him. Come on now. Woof, that was a gamble. Good grief. Okay, so we are going back into the main hall now. Because... So, the only directions I have as far as moving forward are that we need to get the torch so that we can go through the main area. But then there's this set piece right here. I really probably shouldn't be worrying about it. I'm sure they'll direct me where I need to go. Because if you jump down there, All 
All right, let's just go back upstairs to the dark plates. It's a lot of guys. Those guys hit hard. Oh guys, come on now. Woof. everybody feeling right now? Am I jumping the gun on it? I might be. Okie doke. <laughs> Good grief. can heal her at least. It was probably premature. Serious. All right, I'm level seven. Goodness. All right, how we doing? So I'm confused. Here it's saying my MP is 6 of 20. I get it. I have 6 out of my normal 20. This costs 3 out of the 6 that I have. Duh. Okay. Alright. Use on her. Okay. So we are okay for right now. And I can't see a thing. There we go. Man oh man. Okay. Let's... Go back upstairs into the darkness. Is this right? Yes. Did he let us in this way? There's the king. Now just climbs the stairs and finds the throne room. Oh, because that's the ghost ringleader. Oh, that's cool. This is the way the ghost was. Oh. Oh, 
Uh, no. No, I'm good. <laughs> Why would I agree to this? Okay, sure, yes. We trust you implicitly. Ah, who saw that coming? Okay, I got it. Cool, cool, cool. So the entire... The entire deal... <laughs> it's just not a recipe I'm comfortable with. Whoa! Do you want your neck sliced by the scythe of hell? No, then I suggest you start preparing this meal. Yikes. And then we get seasoned. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> we'll be chewing on this one down to the bone because we're skeletons all right okay Ugh. so main guy it's gonna be a slog, I feel like. I feel like he's kind of like a big jump in difficulty. Quit throwing magic at me, please. Goodness. And then, okay, I guess we're just done. <laughs> um, I'll use that on me. Let's go to sleep. Let's take a, a nap. Yes. So I think we can go, if we go the back way, I think that's the fastest way. Right. Right. Oh boy. Let's use that torch. Okay. <laughs> Don't mind me. Well, I think we did it. I think he's gone. <laughs> All right, this is a this is a to do. Hey, fella. Boss music. <laughs> Okie doke. What do I got? Do I have anything I want to use on you? Probably not. I for sure want to lower your defense. Ouch. And I want to do that. Does it work? I want to lower your defense again. don't remember this going this well last time. I mean, should I just keep lowering his defense like crazy? Okay. Okay. Uh, 
Let's see. How many of these you got? Is he actually that bad off? I don't feel like it, but... Oh, no, that's good. Okay, I think it said Dazzle wore off. Okay. Goodness, I was just bad last time. Ugh. Okay. <laughs> I was just really bad last time, I guess. That's... <laughs> These videos are just going to be a continuing embarrassment. A cataloging of my failures. Alright. She learns a sizz. <laughs> we'll leave the castle, I promise. If we all go, there won't be any more monsters coming here, I'm sure. We were forced out of Nadiria, you see. So we were just looking for somewhere nice to live. Surely you can forgive that, right? <sighs> I, oh, I mean... No? I don't know. What's the right answer here? I want to say yes, I can forgive it. Ugh, no. There's no need to be like that. Okay, fine, yes. <laughs> okay, cool. So I have no choice but to be a decent human being. Uh... <laughs> and then we ascended into heaven. I knew it could count on you. I cannot thank you enough. Thank you so very much. We were on t tenterhooks, but now we are so relieved. We can rest at last. The other castle inhabitants already are sleeping peacefully. Are you ready to depart, my dear? Oh, that's sweet. Oh, that is cool. We did it, guys. Well, that's good. <laughs> now the two of them can finally sleep peacefully together. Those ghosts who took over this place were a nasty bunch of... But it's the monsters who came along and killed all those poor innocent people who are the most to blame. Uh, what was that? Don't touch it! Okay. The glowing orb. Uh... What is uh, this gold orb? This globe glows brilliantly with golden light. Uh, okay. Here lies Count Uptaten, whose number is now sadly up. Here lies Miscount, now sadly out for the count. He was quite romantic for a posh count type person. Uh, I suppose we'd be better we better be getting back now. Oh man, okay. Well, I'm glad that didn't take forever. Man, I, I want to fight another one of those things. It totally wailed on me last time. Just embarrassingly so. No skellies. Where am I? There we go. Cha -cha. No, not that way. Attack! Let's straighten that out, good lord. Okay. Well, we done did it. That, um... That was not as hard as I made it out to be, I think. Good grief. 
news of how five and bianca defeated the ghosts of uptaden cap i keep wanting to say like potaten of potaten towers quickly spread through the town that night then morning came a promise is a promise it's her hurry some hurry up and give us that cat i don't know i suppose we don't have much choice Fine, you did what you said you'd do after all. Take the stupid cat. It's good news, isn't it, cat? No more bullying for you. We got a dope cat. Uh, is it officially part of the crew? Uh, hmm. Yep. Okay. Saber's alright by you, isn't it? Yes. Saber it is then. <laughs> alright. I suppose I should have mentioned that my mom's allergic to pets. That means you'll have to be the one who takes care of Saber. You don't mind, do you? Come on, let's get going. We got a cat. Hey, guy. You may be heroes now that you've gone and fought those ghosts, but it didn't mean I'm letting you out of the town alone. Who knows what kind of dangerous monsters may be lying away. Surely not ghosts I fought and killed. Do we have a lot of money? Oh, okay. We'll see here. Do we want stronger weapons? Or better armor? I don't know if she stays with me long, because she, she might leave right after this. Okay, well, what do I need? I could, I could buy this armor. And my stuff go up like, goes up like crazy. Okay, so let's get that. Yes. Um... Man. Okay, I can buy that as well. Sure. Yes. Let me sell what I wasn't wearing. Sell this. All the Wayfarer's clothes. What does she got equipped right now? This, this, and this. Okay, yes, let's sell the pot lid. Let's see. Uh, I don't need the leather hat anymore. Let me sell that guy. Oh my gosh, I'm just using a cypress stick. I didn't even think about that. No, we're good. Okay, I've got to buy an actual weapon. I really want to use that and kind of just use that because I think it's cool looking, but I know that... Uh, I mean, I can get a copper sword or a boomerang, which... If I do that, I'm like attacking multiple groups at a time. That makes stuff kind of easier. Well, I can't afford it anyway. But I can't afford that, which is gnarly. I really do love the idea of him carrying that around. Ugh. Well, I mean, at this point, it's purely... Okay. I mean, it's just a better weapon, so I should use it. Can I get anything for her? Thorn whip? A knife? Or she... She can't even use the boomerang. What am I thinking? So if I got...
You know what? Here's what we're gonna do. This is probably stupid. Uh, this is almost like for sure stupid because I'm pretty sure <laughs> Yes, I'm gonna go ahead and sell This stupid cypress stick five gold Hey man, what's up? How's it going? What are you getting into tonight? Sell her dumb knife. Why is her knife? Well, I guess it is just a stick. I guess we're good. Um. Yeah, I think we're good. It's, you got a lot of nerve rolling up in my stream like this. There. Now it'll show up if you say anything, I think. Okay. Um, so I got weapons. Let's see what the townsfolk have to say. Can't go that way. Sneak in in the back of this person's home. Just filmed a skit where I'm rocking some sweet tights headband in a sleeveless shirt. Okay, what in the world? What are you doing that for? Oh, you're taking that cat off our hands, are you? Well, that's a relief. Wait, that's your cat? Oh, okay. No, 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 that was her, her dumb son. Attack! Attack! I'm Skylar Wolf. That seems great. Hello, ma'am. We killed ghosts. Uh, can we get drunk, please? You should have seen all the kerfuffle last night when people found out what you'd been up to. Oh. Here, I'm going to... The sound's going to cut out for just a second, but I'm going to adjust the... this chat box so it sits in... Um, so I can actually read it. Let's see. Let's see if we do this. This is riveting for anybody watching this. Later, later on. Let's try that and we'll see. All right, I'm moving it. That'll probably be all right. All right. <clears throat> okay, so you were just filming some stuff tonight. That's cool. So you're here to watch the entirety of me playing Dragon Quest V. Let's see. Let me go save. You're brave beyond your years going off fighting ghosts like that. You remind me of me when I was your age. Okay, last time I talked to this guy, he told me just by coming into church, I remind him of him. I think this guy's kind of a... Oh, cool. You've got jokes. Great. <laughs> to watch you walk around a town. You know, sometimes, sometimes, John Paul, in games, you gotta walk around a town. He says it to everyone. <laughs> It's true.
Oh, no. <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. Okay, can I can I jump back in, please? Oh, for the love. <laughs> that is so stupid. All right. Well, let's reset it, I guess. Is there like a soft reset? Yeah, okay. Good grief. John Paul, that's your fault. <laughs> it's true. This game's pushing. It's got, it's got like four thousand horse. Okay. The wailing I used to hear coming from up Taden Towers every night suddenly stopped last night. You've done us a big favor, there, kids. Oh, there's my family waiting for me. Attack! Attack! And do I want to talk to them yet? I guess I got to. I can't believe the two of you went off fighting those ghosts all by yourselves. I know it went well this time, but you mustn't go off again at night doing such dangerous things. Did you hear me, Bianca? And then talk to Mario. You're the town hero boy. It's easy to see how you took after your father, being brave enough to do that. Hey, Paul, you're a, you're a worry sometimes, Five. But at least you're safe. And my cold's all better now, too. We should be getting back to Wheelbrook. Have you said all your goodbyes yet? I mean, I guess. Thanks for everything, Whitey. Five. Looks like we probably won't be seeing each other for a while. Here, take this. It's the weapon that you just spent money on for me. Nope. Bianca's ribbon. I know, I'll tie it to Saber. Hopefully we'll have another adventure together sometime, if I... See you soon. Alright. And just like that, my time with... Oh, by the way, Five. I have to tell you, I was quite impressed by how you took on those ghosts. But you're still just a young boy. You mustn't put yourself in such danger again, okay? Yes, Father. Right. Time to make a move. Sean Paul, you been playing anything lately, or have you just been too busy, uh, game, <laughs> game ends, credits. Ugh, mental picture, that is real bad. Yeah, Dragon Quest V really is just about how we go kill some ghosts at a castle. I get a cat, and then the game ends. Alright. Oh, you're playing, uh, playing the FF7 on Switch? How far are you in it right now? Pancras, welcome home, sir. It's good to be back, my. <laughs> it's good to be back, my man. Where's Sancho? What's he been up to since we were gone? Up, oh, here we go. Hola, señor. I, I is so happy to see you. Como esta? How are you feeling now? Are you still a little unwell? Okay. It was just a cold. Oh, man. Ah, see. While you've been away, senor, these letter. He came for you. I just got a chocobo, ran into the snake in the desert that Sephiroth messed up. Yo, yeah, that thing's rad. 
It's just, uh, it's all like tangled up on a pole or something. Well, friend, I expect you are tired after all Zeus traveling, see? Maybe you have a lethal siesta? I'm purposely not trying to do a, a cartoonish uh, Spanish accent. Okay. Morning five, slept well, I trust. Got some things I need to look into. Yep, but its buddy is still running around and wipes you out immediately. Yeah, you can't fight that thing for a bit. Anyway, I have some things I need to talk, I need to look into, so I'll be staying in today. Make sure you don't go wandering off out of town, understand? Okay, well, this will be a great time. Hello, Sancho. Buenos dias. What's he to you, friend? Are you the one who hid my chopping board, Elsa? What? He said very strange. It's someone who's playing games with me. Chopping board? What are you talking about? Game it. <laughs> <laughs> yep. This game is full of ups and downs. It's a roller coaster ride. Pot, pot, pot. Okay, let's see here. No one wants you to leave town. It's in this bucket. It's in the well. What's this guy talking? Is he still freezing cold? Yep. It's supposed to be summer before long. I don't get why it's so cook cold. Put on like a cardigan. Um, let's see here. Oh, the cat meows three times instead of the... Uh... Well, that's... Me. Hey, guy. Hello. That's an interesting looking gem you've got there. It's a gold orb, you say? May I have a closer look? Uh, sure. Five hands over the gold orb. Wow, it's even prettier up close. The man hands the gold orb back to five. Um... Make sure you take good care of your father, okay? Oh, man. So, these are all essentially, at least, let me think. Um, four, five, six. Yeah. Four, five, and six. Well, almost all the, almost all kind of the, like, early gen console Dragon Quests have all been remade. Um, one, two, and three were made in, um, they were remade for the Super NES or the Super Famicom in Japan. Um, three looks gorgeous. And so then four, five, and six were, I think also for the Super Nintendo, but these are the remakes of those and they all look like this and they all look really, really good. Um, seven was originally for the PlayStation and that one got a crazy 3DS overhaul and that one's really pretty. Eight was for the PlayStation 2, and from then on, they've kind of been... From then on, they've all... You know. Whatever. So, are we just not going to talk about how that's clearly an older me? Right? No matter how hard things may get for you, keep your head held high and never give up. Remember that, okay? Oh man, and you all, you got to see the uh, like the battle stuff. Everything, all the enemies are animated, and everything is really great. Um, I guess we'll go in town and save. I'll show you some fighting if I can get out of town. Don't suppose that splendid-looking fella is still standing outside the church, is he, boy? Uh, are you talking about future me? Because I'm just I don't know what to do. What to do? I wonder if it's me he wants to see. You are. Thirsty for it. <laughs> That's me from a timeline where I never left town. <laughs> Man, the twists and turns this game takes. <laughs> okay, now I need you to make sure I don't... When he asks if I want to keep playing, I have to tell him yes. Yeah.
Yes. Yeah, okay. Ah <laughs> oh, yes, the the infamous no leave town timeline. What can you sell me, guy? Town Quest 5, maybe there's a dragon. <laughs> doubt it though, I really doubt it. Uh, how many of these do I have on my person? I got four of those. None of these, let me grab some of these. But who's gonna carry it? Um, We'll give it to Pupper. That's not a pup, that's a kitty. Did I buy another one of these? Hopefully. Yes, I need a couple. I think that was Antidote. Alright. Right, I already took the thing that you got for me. So... Yeah. Uh, no matter how hard things may get for you, keep your head held high and never give up. Remember that, okay? Okay, so like legit, this is actually like really cool, from what I understand, from the little bits that I've I've picked up on the story, just kind of from playing through before. Like I don't know how or why, but the fact that older me is here telling me like, "Hey man, take care of your dad," and uh, stuff might get hard for you, but stay strong, like. There's there's something there's some cool stuff going on. Ooh, can I buy a weapon for? There's a whole lot of funniness going on here in the village at the moment. I wonder if it's got anything to do with that odd fella who was here the other day. You know that guy who's you. Well, will you sell me anything, please? What if he told you to never leave? <laughs> pot, pot. Barrel, barrel. Um, <laughs> you walk up to him. And he's like, "Hey, maybe." Um, I'm sorry, I didn't eat it. I tell you, honestly, that old dragon of a wife of mine treats me like a child sometimes. I turn my head for a second and come back to find the pot practically licked clean. The old man should just speak up if he's that hungry. Did future me come into this house and eat their food? What do you gotta say? I went hunting about the cave back in my younger days, looking for some of them famous Wheelbrook Blue Stones. Ah yes, I remember poking about them big rucks, hoping for a sign of some ore. It doesn't have to take me back. <laughs> Save the game, call it a day, never play it again. That's what, that's what uh, my guy's telling me. What do you got to say? You're Pancras' son, if I'm not mistaken. This might just be hearsay, but it sounds like he's got an almighty enemy out there somewhere. If only you were more grown up and you'd be able to help him out. Thanks? Hmm, if only you weren't such a burden to your dad. I talk to him and he just says, Hey, never leave town. So what happens if I try to leave town? It's extremely dangerous outside the village. You be a good boy now and go back where you'll be nice and safe. Did I go in here? Okay, yeah. So let's go talk to my dad, because he wanted me to walk around. Essentially, probably I needed to walk around, find freaking future me, and then... Now, hold on. What was Sancho saying earlier? Was it you, friend? Are you the one who hid my who hide my chopping board somewhere. Man, does that come back around? Is that like future me knew he would do something to himself if he had it, and so he hides it? It'd be pretty rad. I have some things I need to look into, so I'll be staying in today. Make sure you don't go wandering off out of town, understand? Okay, so I... <laughs> have I seen everything? No, I need to go, uh, that's right, I need to go this way. 
Let's see what this guy says. <gasps> there's no guy. And there's a raft there. How do we get there? Let's see. I can't get around, can I? Can you help a guy out, future me? Yeah. Let's go fight some stuff in this cave. We got Burr Babies and Boring Bugs. Noichi Top. All right. Yeah, I can't imagine I can actually get anywhere f further than I have before. Hmm, maybe I'm not supposed to go this way. I still, all right, I still haven't learned how to read. I would say this, like, at least this would be, like, good experience for Saber, but, well, maybe it will be. <laughs> yeah, you gotta send that to me when you're done with that. Is that part of the show? Get him, Saber Pup Kitty. Saber's the best. R-U-N-N-O-F-T. No, this is random, just building stuff for the YouTube channel. People could be asking CJ for more on Instagram. What, what did I just miss? Oh, so I moved a rock and there's a wheel book, wheel brook bluestone. Okay, well let's take a look at that. Just got. Is it in the bag? Wheelbrook Bluestone. Yeah, 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 do that. Um, these are visible patches of sparkling gemstone in this rock. Can I use it? That's all it does. I'm an Instagram set of team. We can still be part of his team. What's up, little guy? Okay, so he has the same. Well then, what in the world? I bet I'm supposed to go in the cave and I think he disappears when I do that. Future me disappears. Just make sure we see everything. Man, they do not screw around as far as the random battles. They just toss a million of them at you.
No. Is my boy, uh, is my boy Saber leveled up at all yet? No, he's still level two. And apparently his gender is unknown. So I should say its gender is unknown. Okay, so when I leave, I think, I think guy's gone. There, yeah, I think their gender is unknown. Nope, he's still here. Okay. What am I not doing? What am I forgetting about? There's something I'm missing here. I don't know. Okay. I went down here. I attacked all these things. Pot. Pot. Oh yeah, check this out. Whoa. Yeah, it's pretty great. Okay, I get it. Uh, so can I just go to sleep? Can't wander out of town. Yeah, for real. <clears throat> for sure, got that FF tactics going on. Well, I talked to him. Is there anybody in the inn I haven't talked to yet? Someone's gone and written a weird message in my guest book. It wasn't you, was it? Can I read it? Where's your guest book, guy? I mean, is that it standing right in front of me? So I am... okay. I don't think I picked this up last time, but it sure seems like... Hey, fella. So you're Pancras's son, are you, boy? Come to think of it, I seem to remember there being a King Pancras of somewhere or other once. Not that that has anything to do with your dad, of course. Okay, so this is probably who I needed to speak to. You know, there's a ton of Pancrases everywhere. It's a pretty common name. Uh, okay. So, right. You're that kid who likes caves, right? <laughs> what, the, what the hell is that? Those are great. Those are helpful, thank you. You're that kid who likes caves, right? I'm the guard who was standing in front of the wheelbrook at it before. Ate it, at it. There's a funny fellow in the village at the moment who's causing quite a stir. He was standing by the church last time I looked. You be careful of him, alright? Man, I don't know what those emotes mean, but you just spam them to, to hell and back for all I care. Okay, so we got a ghost person on the bar. Yes, I can see you. Someone who can see me. Okay, so I guess it wasn't future me doing all this weird stuff, but it was little ghost person. Oh, yes, I remember this. One of the houses here in the village has a room in the cellar. Come and meet me there. Ratio. Hold on, I gotta get Tor first. I'm sure there were no glasses here before. Or there was no glass here before. A lot of weird things seem to be just happening lately. Alright. We're off. Okay. <laughs> Chef dog. Burning basket fire basket and uh, Illuminati what's weird about those barrel attack 
Um, hello, ma'am. You came, but I beat you. My name's Honey. I'm a fairy. But our land, our magical fairy land, is in terrible danger. That's why I was sent to the human world, to find help, but everyone's, everyone here has been ignoring me. I even played a few tricks on people so that they'd have to take notice of me. See? You came alone. Shh, someone's coming. Hey, Dad. Son, you're not down here... talking to ghosts, right? <laughs> oh, ghosts. She did. I was sure I heard voices down here, so I thought you must be playing with someone, but I see you're alone. So... I can only be led to believe. It's freezing down here. Stop talking to yourself and come upstairs before you catch a cold. And don't talk to any ghosts. <laughs> it's true. No one else can see me. Anyway, will you come with me to my land? Then Treacle will tell you everything. Uh, oh, I don't have any choice. I just go. It's a win a wonderland. Sweet, you came. Come on, sweet. Come on, I'll take you to meet Treacle. This is totally fine. <laughs> now you're dead. Go to heaven, game ends. Man, this is a weird game. I've brought a human warrior as you requ requested, Treacle. My, what a cute little warrior he is, too. No, no, he's not cute. He might look cute, but he's really not. I mean, he's really... All right, honey, settle down. I can see his potential perfectly well. It's five, isn't it? Welcome to Fairy... Fairy Lee? Lay? Lay? Branching storylines all over the place. The soft and creamy home of the fairies. Well, gross. I believe the reason you can see us fairies when other humans cannot is because you have a special power. And so I have a favor to ask you, Five. Will you help me and my kind? No. Game ends. Now I want to make a game that ends all the time. <laughs> Is that... Well... I think the... Cl mm, I'm trying to think of the closest thing to that. That would be amazing. If you play, like, Papers, Please has, like, 30 endings or something. It's got, like, a whole lot. And you can kind of... But they're all, like, super depressing. Which I think it'd be better if... If the game was basically trying to take itself seriously, but, like, legitimately ended in all these stupid places. Um, so I have a favor to ask you. Will you help me? Yes. You see, one of our greatest treasures, the Herald of Spring, has been stolen. It's a flute that we fairies use to summon spring in all its sweetness. Without it, the bitterness of winter will continue forever. We need your help to get it back, Five. Will you help us recover the Herald of Spring? You never leave the town. Played straight, but funny. For sure. Like, it would be so fantastic if almost every decision you make could end the game. I want you to, I want you to go along with five, honey. Yes, Treacle. Honey joins five. Treacle. It's not Treacle, honey. It says so right there. All right. You get behind my cat. I hope you can help us, Five. You're our last chance. Does she have a picture? She does! Okay. Does she... Okay, she can heal. What else? Does she have any items on her? Oh, she isn't really on the group. So I can't go into any of her. <laughs> go back to bed, game ends. We fairies aren't strong enough to wield swords. We need your help, Five. That's why Treacle asked you. Please, do what she asks. You going to bed? Read, babe. 
Everyone say goodnight to Caitlyn. She's going to sleep. Caitlyn's game is ending. I hope you can help us, Five. You're our last chance. Literally none of us can hold a sword. Can I spin the room around? So I'm inside a big tree. This is cool looking. <laughs> Night sissy. Game ends. Yeah, this is cool. I'm inside a big ol' ice tree. There's no such thing as an ice tree, is there? That's just something I said. Uh, okay, so we can we got a little church inside the tree. The fairies are responsible for the passing of the seasons. If they can't summon spring, the winter will never end and the whole world will freeze. All living creatures are children of the goddess. What brings you... Why am I reading what... He literally says the same thing every time. Okay, I might... I might call it there. Just because that's kind of a clean break where we got sucked into this bottle episode. And so we're going to see what this does. <laughs> it's some sort of winter is coming. It'd be cool if there was a show. Never mind. Um, all right. Yeah, I think I'm going to call it here and then we can pick up. The next time we'll be picking up the adventures of Honey, Saber, and Five, who got sucked into this random, like, Dragon Ball Z side story, where I guess Honey's gonna learn how to drive. We're gonna get her driver's license. <laughs> Alright, well that's game. Uh, thanks for watching. And uh, we'll catch you next time. And that's where I'm going to cut the video. So, or cut the video, Scott says to streamers. If I was to walk from one end of the table. <laughs> it's true. Okay. Well, I guess, um, I guess, Champer, I'm going to, um, I'm going to hop off on here. Let me give you a call it. Ooh, or yeah, like uh, shoot me a text or something. You can you can show me what you got on on Instagram. All right, thanks for hanging out. Uh, have a good night. See y'all.